Welcome back to my channel. This is going to be a Halloween themed segment. Okay, so buckle up, get ready, let's go. We're not only going to bake treats and decorate for Halloween, attend a Halloween party, but we're going to host it. So you get to come along with me and see what I do with hosting a Halloween party that includes everything, including cleaning the garage. So I'm like, and also a time frame. I have 30 hours to put this together. Otherwise, <laughs> uh. now of course I have my inspiration from my Pinterest, so you know I'll be sharing that with you along the way. But for now, let's just get started, okay? This is the current status of the garage. We have the laundry right here, bikes, other instruments of sorts, There's some Halloween decorations right there. I just need a lot more room, so let's get into it. <laughs> look pretty good right now I have a lot of this cleaned up and put away off to the side and that's exactly what I wanted speaking of hello there she is this is my lovely helper this evening so you know she's been a tremendous help <laughs> hi <laughs> After cleaning the garage, I really needed a break, so I decided to go out with my friends and watch a football game. Had a lot of fun, but going right back. So we're just doing a little bit of makeup prep. Taking about 15 minutes to freaking do this. <laughs> I now have about 12 hours left on my clock to get the Halloween party going, and right now I'm just trying to do some makeup so that I can look like my character at least so actually my girls are going to be doing a costume with me and we're doing adaptations of these three characters and they're just a little bit more grown up and everything you'll see what i mean here in a little bit my character is the mean one of the group and she needs to have her eyebrows just this is not my normal makeup so this is kind of hard for me to do <sighs> making the inner eye light the outer eye dark I need lashes. I need my spiders. Where's my spiders? Where are my spiders? What the hell? Thank you. Ask and you shall receive. Oh. Okay, spiders are intact. And now we're gonna go to the grocery store to try and find my decorations and supplies and everything else. So, you know, let's get to it. All right, so I'm here at Target and I'm about to go in and do some Halloween shopping. I'm gonna hopefully get some cool decorations, so we'll see what they have. I legit feel like everyone's staring at me because, you know, my outfit is pajamas and, you know, comfy ass slippers. That just happened to be Jack Skellington. Yeah. Okay, so of course I need some fog machines, so that's what I'm getting. I'm definitely getting like a couple of these just because there are a hundred of them and I need like quite a bit of lights. I'm gonna go to Winco. I'm trying to look for a little creature like bugs. And of course there's like dummy worms, but I also managed to find like these eyeballs and little tiny brains. So we're gonna go with that. I also really like to explore the Halloween aisle just to see what I see. And I kind of see like things that I might be interested in. Like there's this kitty bowl, there's these bowls. So, hmm. So when I was in there, I found this for a little decoration. I also found this one. Then I also have some drinks uh, that I want to set aside, and then hopefully jello shots with uh, these little guys. So I'm on my way to Walmart right now. I'm seeing if they have better decorations and possibly more ingredients. So let's do that. We found it, guys. Fog machine. Boop. Halloween glow in the dark spray and I don't know what I want to do with it yet but like I feel like I'm going to use it for like painting a pathway for the guests to follow so let's see how that goes so I feel like that was a pretty successful Walmart run 
I have got a fog machine. I've now got a little bit more decorations to go on. And I already have decorations at home, so I feel like that's enough for the decorations. Now I just need the final ingredients for some of my things to put together for like Halloween treats, and I'll be good to go. I made it to Vaughn's, but oh my goodness, trying to find my products was not easy. I was able to find Bailey's, obviously, it's pretty common. Um, I decided to get lime juice. I'm not too sure why, but you know, I just figured that needs to be in the mix somehow. They did have little portion sized cups as well as shot glasses. All right, so I don't have very much time. I literally have like four hours left to complete everything. I spent a lot of time shopping, so we gotta go home and get stuff started. All right, so my helpers are here. Here they are, Miss Noel, Miss Avila. All right, girls, let's get started. So right now we are making the jello shots. We are going to be doing Oogie Boogie and we're gonna be mixing in these little tiny worm things. So we're gonna see how that goes. Right now we got some boiling water. So, woo! All right, one cup of cold water coming up. To the bowl and then measure half cup for this. You added more. Oh. But it goes down. It snap. <laughs> Go ahead, place and pour. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Messy pour. That's all you. Okay, so we're setting up. We just need this. Miss Abla, can you bring over the worms and uh, disgusting little things? Okay, we got these. And let's go ahead and dump these. I'm gonna put a finger in this one because I like to be weird and gross and disgusting. Yeah, that looks nice and disgusting. <laughs> Trying to be like fast but also like good about pouring, not trying to spill anything. Watch, I'm gonna spill something right now. Let's see. <laughs> yep, I spilled something. <laughs> All right, now you okay. spill things. Hey, at least you're making the portions correct. Yeah, exactly. There we go. Whoa, that was actually perfect, dude. All right, there they are in the refrigerator. We're gonna come back in about four hours, and boop, dang, woo! Now moving on to brownies. Let's do it. Boop. <laughs> Gonna be doing that. We're gonna cut that open. I need three tablespoons of water for it. Dump it all. Except for that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, don't don't have the plastic in there. Okay. Okay, and then let's see what else. We need a spoon, a whisk, or something. Oh, I found a whisk. Awesome. Okay, so go ahead and pour this in here. There we go. Go ahead. Go ahead. It's like baking cookies with mom. It, the kids want to lick everything. <laughs> this is my favorite thing to do with brownie mix. I like to take Hershey syrup and pour it all in here, just like that. And then I will go over here and take a butter knife. And what I like to do is make a little design in here. So it goes back and forth, back and forth, and it makes like a really cool little design. This way and that way. And now they're ready to go in. to go and uh, do your makeup. So let's do your makeup. It could be like a sunset kind of thing, you know? I'm gonna make you a little sunset. Even though your name is Blossom, we're gonna make a sunset out of you. Mm -hmm. 
So she is gonna be Bubbles, and she's gonna look so pretty with the blue. Ta-da, Miss Bubbles. <laughs> Alright, so currently we have three packages. So we're gonna start by opening some up. Go ahead and open yours up. Yes. These are all the shirts. Okay, so there's pink, there's green, and there's blue in the color group. Have you guessed what the characters are? Because I feel like it kind of should be obvious at this point, but you know, we'll we'll stay with it, okay? You keep guessing, okay? <laughs> I love how you guys are looking at the costumes like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> and they're just what my vision is as these characters are more so grown up. All right, so this is my outfit. I am one of three girls. And here is Miss Avila. She is the pink one. And then Miss Noel, she is the blue one. Together we make up the Powder Puff Girls. Revamped, how about that? Woo! <laughs> yes, uh, so Miss Abla is playing Blossom, Miss Noelle is playing Bubbles, and yours truly is playing Buttercup. So yeah, uh, Miss Noelle, can you give an example of your character? Hi, my name's Bubbles, and I'm gonna be the prettiest girl at the party. <laughs> oh, that's perfect. <laughs> So we're currently setting up everything and what we need to do is just decorate this whole place. So I have Miss Noelle unpacking some lights right now. So pretty. So pretty. We have one hour and 15 minutes before guest star to arrive and this is as far as we got. So we gotta speed this along. We have Miss Blossom currently working on the chairs in the setup and we're having Miss Noelle working on the outside. She's doing fantastic. All right, let's turn on the lights here. All righty, here we go. Miss Noel is handling this beautifully, and I'm gonna start spray painting right in here. I literally have 30 minutes to put this together, and I swear to God, if I did not have these girls helping me, I would die. Literally texting me that they're on their way. We are still setting up, um, but progress is being made. The jello shots are already made, we're ready to go. Uh, we have a table, we're still setting that up a little bit, and we're also having brownies. We have 10 minutes until the party begins, and we just put out spooky treats. So here are the books, they're kind of finally uh, done. Um, I'm gonna have the jello shots ready to go, so you'll see that in a little bit. All right, and here are the final results. I think it looks fantastic. All right, hey ladies. It's the decor, the booze. Oh, we also have a little surprise. Little Marcus the carcass. He's protecting the Stelzers, so, you know, that's always fun. This is the vibe. I love it. Thank you ladies for helping. Beautiful. <laughs> Alright, jello shots, everybody! Cheers! Cheers. 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 Oh. oh! My big old fucking boots. That's why. Laura! Hell in my mouth! You get your tongue in there, go mm. around, and then suck it out. Gotcha. Get in my mouth, baby! Yeah, that's a, that's that's that. That. Wow! It doesn't exist. Oh, 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 shit, shit, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> 